I am Anil Kumar. Welcome to my series on exponential functions. We'll find inverse of the function f of x equals to 3 times e to the power of 2x in this particular video. Now, let us try to understand uh, the function itself first. So, we are given f of x equals to 3 times e to the power of 2x. What is the domain of this function? Let's write down. Now, domain has no restriction. X belongs to real numbers is the domain. However, the range has restrictions, right? So, the range is y belongs to rest, uh, real numbers, but y is greater than 0. Okay? When you actually sketch this function, you get what? Uh, in short, you get a function which is always increasing, kind of like this, right? So, Okay, something like this. Is it okay? Now, we will now find the inverse of this particular function. Inverse of the function, as you know, will be reflection on the line y equals 2x. So, if I have a line like this, it is going to be reflected on this line and we expect something like this as the inverse of the function. Okay. Now, Let's talk about inverse now. As far as the domain of this inverse function is concerned, it will become like flip, right? So domain range, they will flip. So the domain will be x belongs to real numbers where x is greater than 0. And the range will be y belongs to real numbers, correct? So so whenever you're talking about function and their inverse, domain and range swap. So that is the first part. We should actually talk about domain and range for a function, definitely, when we are talking about inverse of a function. Now let's look into the process of finding the inverse. We could write this as 2, 3, e to the power of 2x. To find inverse, what should we do? We need to swap, right? So to find inverse, first step is to swap x and y, correct? So x becomes y, y becomes x. So we write like this, x equals to 3 e to the power of 2y. Now we need to isolate y, right? Since we are working with e, we can take natural log both sides. So we get ln x equals to ln 3 e to the power of 2y. Correct? So ln x equals 2. We can apply the product rule. So it will be written as ln 3 plus ln e to the power of 2y. Clear? ln 3 is basically a constant. Let's take it to the left side. So we get ln x minus ln 3. Here, ln e to the power of 2y is basically 2y times ln e. That is the power rule, correct? Now we know ln e, we, they are reciprocal. Here, since we are talking about take away, we could write this as ln x over 3, right? Equals to 2y since we know that ln e is 1. Correct? So it is kind of multiplied by 1. So from here we can isolate y as half of ln x over 3. Well, half of it means half of x over 3 to the power of half. That becomes y. So we can clearly write the inverse of this function as what? As ln x over 3 to the power of half. Is that clear? Whose domain and range is given here? Right? And that is how the graph is going to look like. Perfect? So that is how we are going to find the inverse of our function. I hope the steps are absolutely clear. Feel free to write your comment, share your views. And if you like and subscribe to my videos, that'd be great. Thanks for watching and all the best.